name is Christine Trin. I am a sophomore from Lincoln North Star. Be good! This thing, it gnaws at my insides. It's not a monster, but it is parasitic. I have been consuming self-hate, but if I have been consuming self-hate, and even that has too many calories, but if self-hate will make me pretty, then I will give up everything. Soon when the self-hate consumes me as a whole, when it gets too nutritious, when my body starts absorbing all the nourishments that it needs, I forget to eat, I forget how to eat, and let go. By the end of the day, I have learned how to seclude myself on my phone in the bathroom visiting with these anything but monsters. When my parents ask me where are all my friends, I reply with this thing, this not monster is my friend. It's a feel good feeling when I'm with this not monster. I feel good, I feel happy, and I connect with it. I tell it my secrets, like how I haven't eaten all day, but I feel great. Then it tells you that it drinks. And you know that is bad, but when it offers you a sip, you do not decline. You take a swig, it's what you stop drinking because of the calories, 100 calories. You can feel your entire self crumble into a heap of dirt. You look over the knot monster for reassurance, but all you get is a glare filled with disappointment. The next day you're tired, the next day you planned on going out, but this thing, your friend, tells you to not go out because, tells you to not go out. Avoid the apple fritter from Starbucks, 400 calories, 400 calories, too many. Going out leads to eating, and pretty girls never eat, while this thing will feed you facts like how to watch your figure. If you eat more than five, six, seven hundred calories a day, you will not be pretty. I wake up on my birthday to find a note left for me by this wicked fiend, and I start tearing up. And these tears turn to streams, but wherever there's a stream, there's a flower bed nearby. And flowers are always pretty. But I had to Google how many calories does crying burn. This is a monster. It gnaws at your insides. And it is parasitic. We have been consuming self-hate for way too long, but no one can survive on that diet. 